자기님 화이팅! 야! 막 시작하신 분 같네 후쿠오카 일본이야? MLB the show's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. Today we bring you Diamond Dynasty action between the Bay Area and South Korea. Stepping in, Tim Anderson, and we are ready for some daytime baseball. Phew. First delivery to him on the way. And that swung on and missed for strike one. First hit, one o'clock. Swing and a miss, and he's quickly in the hole. 0-2. Good timing for this again. Got him swinging in the dirt, and he makes the throw to first. Anderson is retired, and there's one away. In now, Ronald Acuna. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Now here's the pitch. First pitch hack in here, and that's the first strike. Great job by the pitcher right there to pull the string. He knew he had an aggressive hitter at the plate, somebody who was sitting on fastball and ready to do damage, and he was able to slow him down right there and get him off balance. In for a strike, and he jumps ahead one and two now. They love the confidence in that pitch right there, going right after one of the better hitters on this team. Not afraid to execute. Swing and a miss on the fastball that time, out number two. That occurred. The second baseman. First pitch of the at bat. Fastball just misses. That's ball one. That evens it up, one and one. Bases are empty here with two men out. One one pitch is a knuckle curve. He's in the hole now. One and two. And he struck him out. So a fine inning here as he strikes out the side in order. At the plate, Nick Madrigal. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. 아, 또 엄청 느리네. Look at a fastball just off the black, and it's even at one. Two pitch mix here. If you're in the batter's box, you're looking for something up. Sinker change up right here. Got to get it up. Count is one and two now. Now here's the pitch. This is a fun guy to watch when he's up there, really battles, doesn't take any pitches off, he's a grinder, always seems to make it difficult on the opposing pitcher. And good patience to hold back on the curveball in the dirt, it's full now, three and two. Boy, not what you want coming out of the gate as a pitcher, right? You don't want to have to show all oh, of your yeah, pitches this off. early on in the game, but that's a quality of bat, and what does it make you do as a pitcher? You have to use a lot of your pitches, and the more pitches a hitter sees, the better chance they have to make good contact. First pitch of the at bat on its way. And this one's nowhere close as that bounces to the plate for ball one. Gwynn is simply an all around great defensive outfielder. Not only does he have great range and great hands, he's also got a plus arm, the one that base runners and base coaches certainly have to be mindful of. 
Absolutely. When you are in the meeting room preparing for this guy, it is the first thing that jumps off the page. Do not take the extra base. At the plate now, Harmon Killebrew. Strike called. Now the throw down. He is well behind the play. That's an easy stolen base. Here's a late swing and a miss. Strike two. Win leads off second with one gone in the inning. And it's fouled away. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Coming to the plate now, Mike Trout. And he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. Now a bluff back to second as he'll just hold on to it. First delivery to him on the way. Late that time for a strike. That's not a pitch he misses very often. He knows he should have done something with that one. And no swing, apparently. Ball one. Hey, this guy's nasty on the mound. And to check swing and not chase that one puts himself right back in the count. Swing and a liner. And that is down as that could be two bases. And he's in safely at third as they jump ahead with a run scoring on the play. The plate now, Stan Musial. And he puts it on the ground to second. Hap scoops it up on to first, and that'll do it as they manage to not let this inning get oh, out of hand. New inning set to get underway, and that'll bring up the power bat of Edwin Encarnacion. Infield in the overshift here, now the pitch. And he'll start the inning with a pitch that misses off the plate. It's ball one. Well below the knees laid off on the change up there. Popped him up. Musual in foul ground. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Here's Marcelo Zuna. The left fielder, number 20. Marcel Ozuna. Here comes the first pitch. So a rather weak start to the at bat as he misses badly there. It's 0 and 1. You know what that ugly swing tells me right there? This guy's got his good slider work, and that thing's got depth and bite. Behind 0 and 2 now. Nothing in two count and the pitch. Now a swing and a miss. He struck him out, and it's two up, two down to start the second. Digging in, Ryan Klesko, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Hard on the ground toward short, reined in. And a close play at first, but he's called out, and the side is retired. That's Digging in now, now, Jimmy Rollins. He set to lead off the home half of the second. First offering on its way. Fouled away. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. And a pitch in the dirt as he lays off. Oh, the only it's 1 and 1. And a sinker dips too low there. Into the dirt, in fact. That's where he wants that sinker to end up. But that was a nice job of laying off. And he fouls this one off. It's going to be back to some serious T work if he can't put that pitch in play right in his wheelhouse. And a half swing hey, that yeah, time, but it's off. a full swing in the eyes of the umpire, and that'll be the first out of the inning. Now at the plate, Craig Biggio. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. The windup and the 1 0 pitch. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. Pretty easy takes to start out this at bat. None of those pitches were even close to the strike zone. 3 and 0 now. I'd be shocked if this wasn't a four pitch walk right here. He doesn't want to mess around and leave something over the heart of the plate and get beat in this situation. 
Uh, they let him swing away, but he missed the curveball. Three and one. Now he tries to hold back on the swing, and the home plate umpire says he did so successfully. Hmm, it's ball four. Digging in. Blue, first shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. And a sinker dips too low there. Into the dirt, in fact. This is a tough guy to turn two on. It's got to be hit hard. If you're an infielder, you've got to catch it and get going, rid of it quickly. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw. Is there to ring oh, him up? The stealing for Sanchez. Two out, nobody on. Fly ball right down the line and left. Ah, he's almost in the The one two. There's a low changeup that's laid off. Great job to keep your hands back and not fully commit. The body was out in front on a great changeup right there, but he was able and strong enough to keep his hands back. On to Encarnacion at first, and that ends the inning. Encarnacion is holding up. Stepping into the box, Gary Sanchez. He'll lead things the off the against game. Garrett Cole. The captain, Gary Sanchez. Third inning starts a with a slider that's looked at here for ball one. Oh, much too tardy on the fastball. One and one. Fastball is swung on and missed. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. Pitch on the way. Not surprised he's laid on a heater right there. Just saw an off speed pitch. Wanted to stay back a little bit too long. And that one never threatened the zone. It's gone full now to three and two. To be honest with you, I'm a little bit more afraid of the guy on deck than the guy that's up right now. If I'm on the mound, I want this guy up right now. He's the guy that's got to beat me. And he takes strike three called on the fastball. One guy. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. And he goes against the shift there as this is on the ground at the left side. And the off-balance throw beats him at first, and that's a tough play. That's now at the play, Kyle Hendricks. This guy's still looking at a zero in the hit column. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Now a bunt attempt here. And he'll lunge out of the crouch to put this one away. Good reaction. Bottom of the inning now. And next will be the pitcher, Gary Cole. First pitch of the at bat on its way. A ball and no strikes. Ground ball sent back up the middle. And that is through into center. A base hit, and the opposing pitcher gets aboard to kick off the inning. In now, Nick Madrigal. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. There to handle it is Ozuna, and there's one away. Coming to the plate now, no Tony right Gwynn. He right singled here. his last time up. Tony. First pitch of the at-bat. Started to go around, but it's ruled strike one anyway. Hey, it's nearly impossible to turn two with a guy that could run like this. It's even harder when he comes out of the box hitting from the left side. You really need something tailor-made to even have a chance to get him at first. Checks his swing, but this will be strike two call. Hey, now he's got me confused up here. This is a known sinker baller out on the mound trying to roll a double play, and he throws him a four-seamer. So he throws ah, him the strikeout. Tony Gwynn becomes the second out in the bottom of the third. Becomes sick. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. It's a high fly ball headed for the left field corner. If it stays fair, it's gone. And foul, though it had the home run distance. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0-2. Working for the punch out and the offering. Now a check swing, ah. but that's in there for... And the next to bat will be Tim Anderson. He'll lead things off here in this one-run contest. Tim Anderson. 
first pitch on its way. No nope. ball one. Now one and oh. Fastball just inside. The 2-0. Too high. And it's 3-0. and oh. Well, knowing the threat this guy poses if he gets on base, I think the next pitch should be a challenge pitch. You don't want to give guys that can run a free chance to cause havoc out there, especially the leadoff guy. Gwynn has the best view of this one, so he'll take it for the first out. So the base is empty here with one away, and that'll bring up the always dangerous Ronald Acuna Jr. And here's a fastball called for strike one. Got him out on his front foot. It's 0-2. I know we want to focus on the offense and how bad they've been so far, but can we give some love to the pitcher? He has had these guys in the rocking chair all day. To 1-2 and two now. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. Bases are empty. One man out. And he chased it in the dirt. Biggio finds it, and the throw to first is there to record the second out. So striding in, Ian Happ. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Here's the first pitch to him. And this is cut on and missed below the knees, and it's 0-1. I'd like to see this lineup start working the count a little bit more and drive up this pitcher's pitch count. Tried to get him to go after the slider, but it's 1-1. One and one. Half with a two and one count now. Bases are empty here with two men out. And it's two balls and two strikes now. With the way this guy's throwing on the mound, you cannot be chasing. You have to set your sights a little bit lower and control the strike zone. Still hanging with him. Another good swing to keep it going. The two two one more time. Edwin Encarnacion would be next if they can keep this inning alive. Grounder hit hard down the first baseline. Beautiful diving stop. And give it up on a phenomenal play to retire the side. Now to the plate, Mike Trout. They'll start things out against Kyle Hendricks as we get the inning underway. to him on the way timing just to tick off there is this one's fouled off to the right the wind up and the 0 1 uh, tried to pull that one back but he couldn't do it and it's 0 and 2 now good job to spoil that one away and he stays alive Check swing here, but the bat clearly breaks the plane as he set down for the first out. The first Standing in, six. Stan Musial. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Yeah, Matty, and it looked like a sinker in his last A-B that got him to roll over. Kind of similar situation right here. Similar stuff on the mound. Look for them to try and get him to do exactly the same thing as his last A-B. He's got to fight to get it elevated just a little bit more. Now in the box, Jimmy Rollins looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at-bat. Just gets a piece of it, strike one. Two out, nobody on. And a pitch in the dirt as he lays off. It's one and one. Two 
Looked like the fastball got away from him there. It's ball two. And he'll try to hold back the swing, but he'll do so unsuccessfully as that's ruled a strike. The 2-2. Two -two. The count is full. Three and two. Craig Biggio would be next. Trying to send him packing for the second time. Good change up in the dirt. Strike three. And that ends the inning. All ready to go in the top of the fifth. And digging in is the big time power threat. Edwin Encarnacion. We're moving through the middle of this ball game right now. They want to get things going. How about trying to get some base runners on or at least get a base hit? They don't have any hits going into this part of the game. Ready. Here's the first offering. And that's by him. It's 0-1. Look at the radar gun on that slider. Off-speed pitch, 91 miles an hour. That's just pure filth. Oh, it has him looking silly here. It's 0-2. Real ugly 0-1 swing there. As a pitcher, you've got to be hunting for the strikeout knowing you have this guy way off balance. Now a changeup locks him up as he looks at strike three called. One away. Marcel. At the plate, Marcelo Zuna. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blocked. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Under it is Trout, and there are two Ooh, gone now. Utah. Now with the plate, Ryan Plesko. Here's the first pitch to him. Hard hit ball to second. He's right there. Oh, the first to get him easily, and the side is retired. Set now for the bottom oh, of the fifth. Oh, why are you so slow? Going eight, going ten. And that'll bring in the second baseman, Craig Biggio. Now the pitch. Biggio. The 1-1. One, one. That softly hit to right. Will that get down? Half onto the grass. He's there and records the first down. Ah, for them. Riding in once again. Blue. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. A ball and no strikes. One out, nobody on. Count now a ball and a strike. Hit to first. Taken in by Encarnacion. The tag, and he is out. Next to hit will be the pitcher, Garrett Cole. He reached on a single in his first try. Now here's the pitch. Hit the other way out toward right field. Back goes Klesko. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. Leading off the inning, Gary Sanchez. And they'll need him to get something going here. First delivery to him on the way. The 1 0 home. You can see this guy's more focused at the plate right now. In that first AB, he went down on strikes. And he'll lay the fastball in here to get the count back to two and one. Hey. 
strike. And he fires a fastball now for a called strike two. Borderline pitch right there. But as a low ball hitter, you can live with that as long as the umpire doesn't give him north as well. And he struck him out. Strikeout number eight now in the ball game for him. First pitch on its way. Freddie Freeman is at the plate as he watches ball one. Now the 1-0. One and one to count. Here's the pitch. High in the air into shallow left center. Trout has a read on it. He's got it, and there are two down now. Settling in now, Kyle Hendricks. His last at bat didn't go his way as he popped out in foul territory. Yeah, but everything looked clean. He was on time. He looked powerful in the box. I guarantee you he wants to. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And next will be the speed threat, Nick Madrigal. The second base. And that's up and in for ball one. Madrigal. Sent on the ground out to second. Oh, he Hap picks off. it up, and he will whip this one over to first oh. in time for the out. Ready for another oh, shot Lockheed. now. Tony first Gwynn, Lockheed. one for two. Tony. He singled and scored the game's only Gwynn. run back in the first. Grounded back up the middle, and that'll get on through into center, and he's got himself a one-out hit. At the plate, Harmon Killebrew has the first pitch to him is swung on and missed for strike one. No hits to this point. And there's ball one. Hey, they tried to tie him up on that last pitch, so I like that they went away with this one. The execution didn't work, but I like the idea behind it. A little tardy on that swing as it's well wide of first. And there he goes towards second. That's a strike to throw down. The throw is low, and he can't make the pick. Here's the center fielder, Mike Trout. One for two with a triple so far in this one. Looking to keep this a one-run game, the pitch. Oh, one pitch coming. Fly ball out to straightaway right. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Ball set for the start of the inning, and stepping up is the shortstop, Tim Anderson. This thing's far from over, even though we're moving into the back end of this game. Only down by one. All they need to do is get this leadoff guy, and they're an extra base hit away from tying this thing up. Ball one to start the at-bat. The 1-0. Liner towards second. And that's a base hit. So the perfect game bid ends in the seventh. The center field of the 13. Acuna digs in now. And on the first pitch, he grounds foul. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. One strike now from Cole. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. You see that swing right there? You know what that tells me, boys? That this pitcher is doing his job right here. But also the offense is not. Meanwhile here, the throw down to second is not in time, and it's a stolen base. And that'll bring in the Pittsburgh area native Ian Happ. As he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Tough to do much with that one. A swing and a miss. Now you could just see this guy out on the mound right here. Just the body language. He knows he's on top of his game. Executing a nasty slider down the way right there. Giving this offense no chance. Throw goes over to third. And he'll reach first as they can't make the play on him. And then Encarnacion now. Because he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. First pitch of the at-bat. Boy, not the way he wanted to start out here. It's 0-1. Hey, this guy's been throwing a gem so far. We're moving on later into this game. And he's right at about league average for first pitch strikes. Fouled off. A 
now and a big swing by Encarnacion as this is sent out to nice. deep left field. Gone. Ah. And that one had some extra distance. Ah. And that'll bring in Marcelo Zuna. And he's a bit tardy there on the first pitch fastball. It's nothing in one. He's 0 for 2 in the ball game so far. Swung on and hit in the air again, deep down the left field line. Trout is going to get there to make the catch a few steps into foul territory for out number two. So digging in now, Ryan Plesko. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Hit sharply but foul down the right side. The wind up and the 0-1. Out in front as this is pulled foul into the seats. The wind up and the 0-2 pitch. Stone cold take right there. That fastball very well could have sent him packing back to the bench. Ah, oh, you get this. Swing and a drive to center field. That one's got a chance. A ball that's carrying. And he makes a nice catch on the track as that ends the inning. Last half of the seventh here. And next it'll be the outfielder, Stan Musial. The first baseman, Stan Musial. First pitch coming. Here it is. Line drive, and that's a base hit into center field. Hal Newhouser takes the ball here as he'll enter with a runner at first. Okay, to us, sir. And nobody out. Stepping in now, Jimmy Rollins. As he takes a cold strike on the black, it's 0-1. And he falls behind 0-2. We're in the seventh inning with a good finish brewing. 3-1 our score. And it's fouled away. shot down the line but this will be a foul ball and it's still 0 and 2 nothing in two count and the pitch just missed with that heater but even if he wanted to swing I don't think he could have caught up to that one skied into straightaway right and Plesko will be under it to put it away for the first out Ready once again, Craig Biggio. He's 0 for 1 thus far. He's set and the pitch. And now here's the ball hit pretty well out toward right center field. Plesko is over to his right as he puts this one away. Two down. Digging in once again, Blue. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Here's the first pitch to him. Now a fastball a bit too low here. It's ball one. A runner on first with two away. Can't sit back long enough, and the count evens up at one and one. And he takes one off the inside corner for ball two.
Two balls and a strike. Here it comes. This one's outside. Quite a bit off the plate that time. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters. So you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. Three and two, full count. Now the payoff pitch home. Gets him looking at the knees for the strikeout. Ah. Ready to begin the eighth. And the next yeah, bat, the Dominican one catcher, ah, Gary Sanchez. Gary. First offering on its way. And that's high for a ball, 1-0. and oh. That was a tempting pitch to swing at right there. A big power guy like this really wants something that he can elevate and drive out of the ballpark. Oh, and that looked like the very definition of flailing there. It's even at one. Strike two, swinging just out in front of the slider. Step out of the box and wash that one off because that was an ugly swing. Slowly down the third baseline, but this is a foul ball. Is the count hold steady at one and two. Ah, it's just a tennis game. Now a fastball, but that's easy to lay off, and it's back to even at two and two. Did a good job to shorten up and protect the plate, and he'll have another shot at it here. He struck him out the third time he's fanned in the game. The Digging in, game. Freddie Freeman. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Now time is called as both guys in the bullpen are ready to go. So with a left-handed hitter waiting, they'll go to their own left-hander out of the bullpen. DJ LeMayhew will move into the on-deck circle now to try to get something started here with one gone in the inning. And he got him out in front that time. Strike one. Chased a low ball there, and he's quickly down in the count 0-2. Chapman is about as stingy as they come in terms of a bullpen arm. He's proven very difficult to hit, and it's a rarer thing still to see multiple hits against him. Yeah, Matty B, and you wonder why it's so hard to score off of this guy. He's nearly impossible to get three or four hits in an inning to score a run. He keeps his walks per nine inning is really down, and you look at his hits per nine innings pitch, it's no wonder why this guy's one of the top relievers in the game right now. Ryan Zimmerman will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Tried to check it, and it's 0-1. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. A ball and a strike. Eighth inning of this low scoring affair. Three to one our score. And he's behind now as he missed badly on that swing. One and two. I'll tell you, if I'm pitching right now, I'm not throwing anything near the strike zone until these guys prove they can lay off it. They're just being way too aggressive. This one misses, and that'll fill the count here. Three and two with two away. Well, he really needs to make this guy swing the bat right here. He's not the type of hitter you want to dance around with. And he lays off ball four. So he comes right off the bench and works the walk. Usually easier said than done. And he swings through a fastball and doesn't catch up with it. It's 0-1. That was a pretty good fastball after he walked the hitter previous. There was a little angry on that heater. Behind 0-2 now. Protecting with two strikes, ah, one out of the zone right, that time, but he off. stays alive. That was a nasty pitcher's pitch right there. Most guys strike out on that one. He was able to scramble out a little bit and give him another chance, and hopefully this pitcher misses over the heart of the plate. Got him looking, and that ends the inning.
Will Smith. It's on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. So striding forward now, Aroldis Chapman. And he's getting his first plate appearance here in the eighth after entering off the bench just a little bit ago. あ、え、ライニングフォーカスしてよ。あ、ライニングポルトギーネセスでね。ライン MLB도 재밌죠. MLB 무료로 줬잖아요. 아, 저거 <웃음> 아, 저도 오늘 제 스스로 무너졌네요. 안 무너질 수 있었는데. Boy, he sped him up in this at bat. Now it's time for the changeup. This guy's got a good one, and he hasn't thrown it yet in this at bat. He's set. Here's the two-two. 우리 팀 힘내요. Bases are empty. One man out. Line drive to left, but pretty much right at the left. 네, 아쉬워요. 우리 팀 잘할 수 있었는데. 이번 이번에 알파타오리 아시네요. 야ボールあ、ボールあ、ボールあ、ボールあ、ボールあ、ボールあ、ボールあ、ボールあ、ボールあ、ボールあ、ボールあ、ボールあ、ボールあ、ボールあ、ボールあ、ボールあ、ボール
한해 공격이 남았으니까요. 드리런을 맞았네요. 네, 카시오나스. 네. 라인님도 수고하셨어요. 다음 주는 화이팅입니다. <웃음> 이세요 오늘 고생 많으셨어요. 아 오늘 되는 게 없네 되는 게 없어. 오, 바로. 아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아아